Hello guys, today I'll be talking to you guys about the latest arc of One Punch Man, but the the arc is called um, the the here the Monster Association arc. But today I'm here with a friend of mine. Like this guest is a really cool guest. Uh, his name is the Scribbling Shadow. Come and introduce yourself, Shadow. Hey guys, what is up? It's Shadow here. And uh, thank you so much, Krista, for having me on your video. No worries, man. Anytime, anytime. So, uh, so you know what we what we will be talking about today, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Of course. Mm -hmm. So, the the latest arc of 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 One Punch Man. What do you think about the the, the Monster Association arc? Okay, so honestly, this arc is one of my favorite arc of One Punch Man manga. Especially, this arc has lots of action. Uh, the story progression is really good. Uh, we got to know about lots of other heroes, like uh, all of them, like other A, B, or C class heroes that we never knew about, and their true potentials. And uh, the most beautiful thing about this manga is the frames the illustration of all those fight scenes those brutal fight scenes and the attention to details it's so good all of it it's so good yeah can, and, can, um, yeah go on yeah but yeah the, 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 that one disappointment is that um our cape baldy could have more <laughs> screen time <I> guess. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, but but, yeah. but but it's true because like this arc, like the author is not afraid to show what's happening. Like, mm -hmm. like we got a ton of mm -hmm. of, of uh, development. We got to see all the fights between all the heroes, mm -hmm. and it's honestly mm -hmm. something that a lot of manga kind of skip over s sometimes. Like they show it mm -hmm. a few times, but not all mm -hmm. the characters. And we get to see that in this arc. We we get to see. A bunch of heroes that honestly I didn't really know until this arc. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So and it's yeah, that the character developments are really good. Speaking of that, um, there is a question for you. Yeah. Um, what are your opinions about Garo? Garo. His character developments, uh, development is really good. So, what are your opinions? I'm gonna be honest, Garo is one of my, my favorite characters in One Punch Man. Right um, next to, yeah, yeah. to Saitama, because like, the character progression that the, he got, especially in this arc, it's huge. Mm -hmm. It's huge, and, and, yeah. and the thing that I like about this is like, Garo is supposed to be technically a villain, right? He, 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 he's, mm -hmm. a, he's a villain, he's, he's trying to take mm -hmm. down all of the you know heroes and seeing his his mm -hmm. progression through all of it, mm -hmm. seeing seeing him, him him progressing, seeing his his relationship with mm -hmm. Bang, there's so much yeah. stuff happening. Like I love Garo as as a character, and I think that a lot of people who have to, who are reading the One Punch Man manga mm -hmm. love him as well. Mm -hmm. I'm sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. For sure. So, Shadow, actually, that, that's another question I want to ask you. What are the, mm -hmm. the two favorite moments of, uh, of, 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 of this arc? Mm, okay, for me, there are a lot of moments. Uh, those are my really favorite. But uh, the most favorite one for me, obviously, will be the Tatsumaki versus Psychos. Yeah. That was epic. It was epic. And... Um, yeah, the teamwork between Tatsumaki and uh, Genos, and uh, yeah, the uh, the second one for me will be the current fight scene that uh, between Garo and Silverfang. Yeah. But uh, th there's one fight that really you know stuck in my brain that is that is really hilarious, like the zombie man versus vampire. Oh, I've seen that, that fight. one. <laughs> oh, it's it's so funny. Yeah. It is you know this Deadpool kind of concept. So he's just <laughs> dying and getting back to life. <laughs> that is so funny. Oh man, nah, cause like the Zombie Man, he 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 is one of my yeah. favorite characters. Not like the best, the yeah. best, but yeah, he is definitely a really good hero, and then I really like him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no doubt. So that that fight 
will be stuck in my brain for a while. So <laughs> yeah, yeah, that yeah. is my favorite fight. And uh, yeah, t- talking about Tatsumaki versus Psychos, uh, the teamwork between Tatsumaki and Genos was really good. It was, and, it uh, was. Speaking of that, I I really have a silly, or you may say a st- stupid question. <laughs> but, um, no question <laughs> is stupid, man. <laughs> okay, the question is, who you prefer, Saitama and Genos or Tatsumaki and Genos as ship? <laughs> a ship, okay. When it comes to Tatsumaki and Genos, I am enjoying, mm-hmm. like, I wouldn't mind it, but mm-hmm. <laughs> honestly, I, I, I prefer Tatsumaki and uh, Saitama, because <laughs> like, like, they're so similar. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, and yeah. when it comes to Genos and Saitama, no, I don't think that's, that's no, I don't know shit about it, I don't know shit <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so it, uh, that kind of seems like Gozo and Itadori. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's that kind of relation. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Okay. Uh, I don't know why to ask this to someone. So speaking of 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 mm-hmm. of, of that um, of uh, Tatsumaki, what do you think mm-hmm. of the? Um, current events in the manga, like currently, like in these latest chapters, what do you think of it? Mm-hmm. Okay, so, I really like the current arc, um, I think it's in a good pace, it's not so slow, not so fast, like they're building a good amount of hype for the biggest fight, Yeah. You know? That surprisingly rhymed. <laughs> 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 and, uh, yeah, I really like these um, uh, this arc because uh, you know the, we we are being presented some really strong monsters. Yeah, in l- the current l- chapter l- they're they're too strong um, for these S rank heroes. Yeah, they're way too strong, uh, and, and that's something yeah. I really really l- yeah. like about this arc. Yeah, like yeah, like uh, that evolved uh, ugly fur. Ugly, he yeah. just spit and killed three S rank heroes. I mean, what? And <laughs> I don't think uh, rank heroes. I don't think that they're S rank. Yeah, I think they're like A or B rank. Know, yeah, uh, yeah, you can say that. They're yeah. friends of like but, but uh, Atomic Samurai. Is that his name? Mm-hmm. Yeah, Atomic Samurai is a comrade. Yeah, uh, those people. So he just killed them. But uh, yeah, he just uh, you know um, injured. Uh, what is that guy? Uh, Black Shine. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, so he just, um, you know, I don't think he can fight anymore. Yeah, he like, just, you know, yeah. Dark, dark shine. <laughs> He's been humiliated <laughs> so much in this arc. Yeah. My God, because I like, mean, Golden S. Yeah, Golden S. Golden S. S Garo. Uh, evolved ugly for it. Yeah. Garo and Maya Mask, and, you know, pay, putting some sense yeah. into him, and then boom, and then nothing happens. It's like, yeah. my the character yeah. progression just went out the window. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, and so, yeah, I'm liking the current chapters. And, yeah. Um, let's see how the event's gonna turn out, because um, they, you know, build up a really good hype, good amount of hype. And, yeah. Um, Regarding that, I have a question. Um, what do you think about the future of chapters of this manga will be like with respect to the original manga? So when it, when it comes to yeah. the you know the the ones comic, that one uh, of course I've I've read ahead. I've read ahead. I know how, like roughly what's going to happen in this, in this arc. But I mean, it's. N- n- I mean, that's one story. This is Morato we're talking mm-hmm. about. We don't know exactly what's gonna happen. Like, we never imagined Garo versus Fang this early. Yeah. We never. N- n- mm-hmm. n- like, so much stuff that that's happening in these arcs, mm-hmm. no one expected, right? So when it comes mm-hmm. to the future of this arc, even though I've read ahead and yeah. I know what's gonna happen in the ones. Well, in, in, in one story I don't know what's gonna happen mm-hmm. like I don't know like, mm-hmm. l- 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 like for all we know <laughs> yeah. the the entire mm-hmm. one story might be com- com- completely scrapped and just ha- have a new ending yeah but do you have any kind of idea like we saw we just encountered God or yeah, whatever that l- being l- is do you think 
he will interrupt or something. Okay, him interrupting, I don't think that's gonna happen. But mm -hmm. I am seeing something to do with God, like him either waking up and 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 then then we see him in the next arc, or just mm -hmm. we find some brand new information about God because uh, yeah, that, we that need makes to. sense. Yeah, yeah. Okay, because like mm -hmm. I I I don't think God 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 is, is gonna show up. I I don't think. Mm -hmm. that, that is yeah, going to show yeah. up this early. Like, okay, sure, okay. we've gotten a ton of hints about God and we got shown yeah. God, but I don't mm -hmm. think God is going to show up this early. I don't. Yeah. Like, I, I can yeah, see it's kinda it the wrong way. Like a, a picture of, like, there is a God being that can be encountered in, uh, you know, any other arc. But I guess this arc is uh, really focused on God. -o. Yeah, it, it really is. It really is. Yeah. Speaking of Garo, what do you think of his uh, transformations and stuff in, in this arc? Yeah, Garo is really strong. I mean, he just surpassed his human limits and uh, he's just, you know, just learning all these moves. Just like you, you have seen the fight between uh, the evolved Garo and, or you can say the demon Garo or the monster yeah. Garo versus Bomb. Uh, and Silver Fang. He's yeah. just learning their moves so, so fast. Quickly. So quickly. Yeah. Well, yeah. Well, I don't like think uh, any S rank hero can defeat him apart from Saitama. Yeah. I don't think that anyone else can defeat Garo uh, yeah. where he is right yeah. now. But the thing that really, really just shocked like me. Uh, comic. Uh, so the one thing that really, really shocked about Garo was when Bang, he used his removal. When he removed uh, mm -hmm. everything and, uh, and like he is about to go like surpass his limits and uh. and, and use that ultimate technique, I forgot the name. But when Garo mm. straight up copied his breath te yeah. technique, I was like, mm. "What? Yeah. <laughs> is it, like you just copied it yeah. that easily? My God! L yeah. l like Garo, Garo, he's been evolving. He's been doing so much stuff." Yeah. And I'm excited to see what's what's gonna happen next, especially in this arc. Like, yeah, same here, same here, man. Especially with also gold, uh, uh, golden S, golden S. Like, mm -hmm. uh, where he did the dark shine, <laughs> it was so funny. <laughs> but I still yeah. want to see more of of, of uh, golden S. Yeah, I really like those, his. You know, yeah, Jojo vibe. Yeah, exactly. Because like, because like, I saw uh, Gold Ness and I was like, Jojo. Yeah, <laughs> Jojo, you came stuff from from Jojo. Ah, <laughs> uh. <laughs> I just heard everybody saying ora ora ora. <laughs> yeah, would you need that? Would you need that? Like, <laughs> uh. No, but like, yeah. s s seriously, Shadow, thank you very, very, very much for yeah. for, for joining me in thank this you for video. Having me in the channel, man. Yeah, okay, because like I, I've been meaning to talk about this arc for a while, and I don't want to talk about it alone. Mm -hmm. I want to talk about it with yeah. with, with a close friend me and too. your I and mean, your close friend. Yeah, me too. I really wanted to ask that question, like, uh, who do you ship? Uh, <laughs> Saitama or Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really wanted to know. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, once again, thank you very much, Shadow, for coming in hit into the mm -hmm. channel. Do you have any a anything mm -hmm. to say before we, we wrap this video up? Okay, subscribe to this guy. He <laughs> makes really good content. He suggests really good manga and anime. He suggested me some of the good mangas and anime. So please subscribe to him. Watch his video, okay? And don't forget to subscribe to him. And watch my video too and yeah, yeah, some, yeah. Uh, you know uh, anime spoof animation uh, is not so good but I think you can enjoy it so yeah oh so, so speaking of that uh, have you checked uh, Cho Chojin X the, the series that, that I recommended which is by the author of Tokyo Ghoul I'm really sorry. <laughs> no, you haven't. I was busy. It's fine, man. You know, uh, those yeah, yeah, yeah. No so worries. I'll check. It. I'll check it. I'll check it. You, out. you need to check it out. Like, if Tokyo Ghoul was amazing, mm -hmm. th this one is, is going to mm -hmm. be the next, the next Tokyo Ghoul. <laughs> Straight up. Yeah. Uh, ho I hopefully, we get a good adaptation for this series. Because <laughs> yeah. the anime yeah. of Tokyo Ghoul was bad, unless we get a remake. But hey. 
That's what you're thinking. But uh, like I said, thank you very much for, for coming here to Shadow. Uh, guys, yeah, come and so, so subscribe to, to my channel, of course. Go ahead and subscribe to Shadow as well. Because like you said, he makes, like, this guy's content is really, really good. Like, especially if you, go, if you guys like Naruto, Jujutsu Kaisen, go, go and see his series. Because his series, is, go and see his channel, because his channel is really, really good. Like, he, he straight up makes a what-if scenario for Naruto mm -hmm. and Jujutsu Kaisen <laughs> and, a, and a bunch of other series. Honestly... You you won't you won't regret so sub, subscribing to his channel. Also, come ahead and, and, and subscribe to my channel as well because I make anime and manga re reviews pretty much weekly. I am trying to upload daily, but uh, we'll see from my time frame to see my, my schedule and everything. But uh, thank you very much, Shadow, uh, and I'll see yeah. you all Anytime, bro. next time. All right.